without us noticing, modern life has been taken over. As we search for love, shop online, travel the world, even as we save lives, there are step-by-step -step instructions working quietly behind the scenes. More and more, they're ruling our lives. They're called algorithms. Algorithms are everywhere. These bite-sized chunks of maths have become central to our daily lives. But because they're invisible, we tend to take them for granted, even misunderstand them. What is the most efficient way to sort a million 32-bit integers? <laughs> They're the secret to our digital world and so much more. In this program, I'm going to show you some of my favorite algorithms to reveal where they came from. Algorithms are ancient. How they work. The challenge is to find the shortest route. These are the rough instructions that you would use for returning to your starting point. What they might be able to do in the future. The algorithm's kind of writing itself, or? Uh... Absolutely. And how we can't live without them. Even when we're baking a cake, we're following an algorithm. As a mathematician, I love algorithms. Not only are they impressive problem solvers, but they're also strangely beautiful, tapping into the mathematical order that underpins how the universe works. Welcome to the weird and wonderful world of algorithms. Most of us carry one of these around. Now you might have noticed that when you take a photo with your phone, then it draws a box around any face like this. This is the result of a special face detection algorithm, and it helps to keep the face in the photo in focus. Like all algorithms, this one solves a problem. In this case, finding a human face. While it's not fooled by a face made of fruit, it does detect a human face in a photo. So how does it do it? At their root, algorithms are little more than a series of step-by-step -step instructions. This one works by methodically scanning the image looking for four particular abstract patterns associated with a face. When these are detected one after another, then the algorithm indicates it's found a human face. The process taps into the underlying pattern behind all faces, no matter what shape or size. The end result